like this sword skin, but I don't think I'm gonna spend G cubes for it. Today's video is a bit different, it's gonna be a lot of talking, so sit back and listen to the things that I have to say. Okay so, let's talk about the thing that happened to Blockman Go yesterday, every single player knows what happened yesterday, it seemed like a very big issue but Blockman Go fixed it. If some of you watching are still confused about what I'm actually talking about, I'm talking about the unexpected Blockman Go server outage that happened yesterday, there were a lot of rumors and other things that kept spreading, even some YouTubers got hacked like Matt Sun, I think he lost all his G-Cubes too, kind of sad, but it's gonna be fine because the Blockman Go devs will get it fixed. So let's talk about what really happened yesterday. The entire game just stopped working, I couldn't log into my account, I was like oh, I guess I got hacked again, no big deal, let's just tell the admins to get my account fixed, but apparently it wasn't just me who couldn't log in, literally every single player who had Blockman Go couldn't log in, Blockman Go had kind of blocked every player from logging into their accounts, I know right, does sound a bit scary. So I just sat there and thought about what type of content I could make if Blockman Go stopped working, and I had two games in my mind, which were Minecraft and Roblox, comment down below which game you would like me to play if Blockman Go stopped working for a while, anyways, I got a message from a guy I know, and he explained me everything that was going on behind the scenes, I honestly don't know if that information was true or not but I'm gonna mention it in this video anyways. He mentioned that some hacker group literally hacked Blockman Go servers and got everyone's IP address, I just kept listening to what he was saying and then boom, Blockman Go did an announcement stating that their servers had a major issue and they had to go into maintenance, no one could play Blockman Go for the entire day, I thought they were gonna take almost a week to fix this issue, but surprisingly they fixed it in one day, they sure did a good job on the maintenance. But I hope they realize that they should be more aware of their game's security if they actually got hacked or something. I was planning to make a different video when I got hacked. But I decided to make this video instead, luckily I didn't lose anything, I have my 3000 G-Cubes, I have all my runes too, so I don't think I got hacked yesterday, or maybe I did, I'll never know, it seems like everything is back to normal and players have started playing again. Which is a good thing. I'm curious to see what type of stories or rumors you guys have about this mysterious maintenance break of Blockman Go, let me know your thoughts down in the comments, I actually want to know all the theories about it. Do it! Just do it! I also saw that some people got the extremely rare rainbow wings in their inboxes, I have tried those wings in Rishu's account, and believe me, you never want anyone to wear those wings in Bed Wars. only one person with those wings can make the entire game lag. Imagine if all the players had those giant wings, the game would just get wiped out due to lag. It kind of feels good to be back in Bed Wars, I feel like I haven't played this game for a while, I mean yes I do upload videos daily but the recent two videos were pre-recorded, I am still thinking about creating some different type of content actually, do let me know what you guys will be interested in. For now, let's focus on winning this round and moving on to the next one, there are no tough players in this round so it's kind of relaxing to kill all these players with ease, I might sound cocky but it's the truth, these players are easy to kill. This team has Obsidian as their bed defense, that's why they deserve to be spawn killed until I get the chance to break open their Obsidian bed defense. Give it to me! Give it to me! Give it to me! Give it to me! Just give it!